Several bicyclists are traveling from Jeffersonville to Madison, Indiana today as part of a 13-day ride. The majority of the riders are members of law enforcement and part of a group called Cops Cycling for Survivors. WLKY's Christina Mora has more. Today is a perfect day for a bike ride. It's day 11 of a 13 day trek. Members of law enforcement are riding their bikes to honor their colleagues who died on duty. And this morning, the group met a little boy whose father died before he could meet him. 10 year old Isaac Patrick is gearing up for a ride today, honoring someone very close to his heart. I'm riding my bike because my dad was a police officer and he was killed. Isaac was born six months after his dad was shot and killed in December of 2003. His mom makes sure he knows exactly who his dad was. He says I'm like him, like no way. Like what? Like I like I ha I can play basketball and football. Isaac helped start Thursday's portion of the ride. About 20 riders, many of them members of law enforcement from all over Indiana, started their day in Jeffersonville and will end in Madison. Day 11, we can see the light in the tunnel. Uh, it has uh, been a long ride. Uh, it's been well worth it. Cops Cycling for Survivors started in 2002. Each year, the group rides for 13 days all across Indiana, honoring officers killed in the line of duty. Uh, unfortunately, we've lost already three officers in line of duty in the state of Indiana in just a very short period of time. Uh, we'll be honoring those officers next year on 2015 ride. Isaac's portion of today's ride may be short, but these cyclists are doing their best to make sure his father's memory stays alive. In Jeffersonville, Christina Mora, WLKY News. The 13-day bike ride wraps up Saturday at Butler University in Indianapolis.